If Amazon has its way, your order might one day be delivered to your doorstep by a drone. This was just one of the possible uses for the unmanned aerial vehicles being discussed as thousands gathered for the first ever commercial drone expo in Los Angeles on Saturday. Long used by the military for surveillance and to carry out attacks, USA VSA, Unmanned Autonomous Vehicle Systems Association, said their objective in staging the event was to soak interest in different uses for drones among the industry and enthusiasts. Possible uses included delivering medicine to remote locations, and a musician Dead Mouse offered fans a tour of his home using a drone. The mobility of these flying vehicles have introduced a host of safety and privacy issues, says attorney Lisa Elman of McKenna, Long and Aldridge. Given the unique mobility of drones, uh, people are very concerned that um, someone's going to spy on me in my own backyard, or a company is concerned that their competitors might be spying on them and their projects. So there's a broad concern kind of across the country that we've heard from the American public about drones and that they may impede our own personal privacy. Drones, hundreds of them, were on display at the Los Angeles Memorial Sports Stadium. Some featured rotating cameras and multiple rotors, while others looked like model airplanes. Expect new models to be smarter and smaller, says Professor Rajas Singupta, a professor of robotic intelligence at the University of California, Berkeley. So at the top of the intelligence chain, you would like to tell a drone something like, go find my kid, my kid's lost in the woods. And it will not only just find any kid, it'll find your kid. The commercial drone industry is expected to be an $82 billion industry by the year 2025. We're looking by 2025, we're looking at $82 billion just here in the United States. 100,000 new jobs. The, the drone industry is ready to explode, and, and, but the policy making hasn't quite kept up yet. The technology has moved ahead, so that's some of the, the issues that we're seeing.